Man, tired. I ain't going to lie. Uh, that was a lot of running right there, what I did. And uh, I don't think I was going to be able to go that next place. So I just, uh, you know, just told saying I just needed a break right there. The, the play at the end, I mean, they, they got pressure on you. Right yeah. To you, like, you, just looking back at that, is there anything else you wish you had done a little bit? I mean, uh, I wish I would have, you know, bought some more time right there. You know, I saw they overloaded the right side, and I was trying to, you know, buy some time going left so the receivers could get down the field. But they got on me pretty quick, so I was just trying to, you know, get the ball to, you know, the running back right there so he could, you know, try to make some space and just make a move. But, you know, uh, probably buy some more time. That's probably what I wish I would have done more. It looked like a lot of deep shots you were trying with that first half. Was that what the defense was giving you at the time? Was that strategy? Well, it was opportunities, you know. Uh, we knew that they were going to try to take away some of the, the deep shots like uh, one high, but they played us in man. So uh, we like our matchups. We like our you know receivers to get open. You know we just got to execute at the end of the day. But you know we felt like they gave us the opportunity to take advantage of certain things. You know we tried it, but just execution got to come down better at the end of the game. Not not necessarily, you know, because. Um, you know, like I said, execution, you know, we know that was an opportunity right there. You got to take advantage of every opportunity that the other team gives you because you know, you're not going to get those opportunities every time. So we really just got to, you know, just, just execute and just take advantage of it. Anthony, I mean, I know this is very meaningful to you. When you don't have success individually or as a team, how are you kind of dealing with that process in that right now? I mean, it hurts, man. You don't want to lose, bro, especially not in the division, you know, not in this league. You don't want to lose, you know, so it definitely hurts, you know, uh, taking those L's. But you learn from, you know, it's, it's nothing but a lesson. You know, we know what we got to clean up. You know, execution got to be top tier for us. We just got to play better. This has been, it's been a roller coaster because you got hurt, you know, there's been some ups yeah. and downs on the field. Um, how, have you seen growth? Do you feel like you're growing? Oh, yeah, yeah, for sure. You know, I feel like I'm, you know, trusting my teammates more. I'm trusting, you know, the game, letting the game come to me. I feel like I'm playing within the game, you know, making plays and just doing what I'm supposed to do. But, you know, like I said, at the end of the day, execution got to be better, you know, from both ends. You know, that's whether from, from me delivering the ball to the wide house, you know, and, and them catching it. You know, we just got to execute at the end of the day because we know what we can do. We just got to do it. Anthony, we know you're still quite early in your career. It's only been 10 starts. Yeah. Just, as you look at yourself, where do you, where do you feel like you are as a passer? I mean, uh, how have you been progressing or – I feel like I'm a great passer. You know, uh, I've been playing quarterback pretty much my whole life. You know, uh, I'm just a different quarterback from everybody else. So people are going to try to point out that uh, I'm not as efficient as everybody else. But you know, it's cool to me. You know, uh, I run the ball way better than every other quarterback. You know, probably not Lamar, but uh, than most quarterbacks. So you know, I, I take advantage of my opportunities. You know, I just use my powers to the to the best of my ability. And when I am delivering the ball, you know, I feel good about it. And when I'm running, it, I feel good about it as well. That drive where it, you had the pass to Downs, it almost was a touchdown. It kind okay. Of like I just feel like we executed. You know, uh, we already had all the shots. You know, we had all the opportunities. You know, to just go out there and just play. Uh, that drive was just a good drive right there. JD made a great catch at the end of the drive, and you no know, JT finished it off. So it's just execution right there. Man, uh, we were looking for a certain look right there, and then you know they they didn't really give us that look. So I killed the play. I checked it. And then they they just played a good zone right there, and uh, JD was pretty much my only target right there. And I thought I was able to fit it in there, but the nickel just did a great job of just jumping under it. So you know, got to give some props to him. Anthony, you're the last guy off the field at halftime. I saw you just tapping your chest and giving guys uh, fist bumps. Why did you choose to do that? What do you hope that actions like that kind of do? You know, I don't I don't really like hope it does anything. You know, I'm just letting my squad know that like, I'm still in it. You know, regardless of what happened in the first half. You know, we didn't really do our best right there, but. So what? You know, it was the first half. The first half was that. I told the guys at halftime, like, don't even worry about the first half. Let's go out here and execute in the second half and just be better. You talk about being a different type of quarterback and being a great runner. Is, is that something maybe you can lean into more just to add, you know, add more plays right now? Um, maybe. You know, uh, the opportunity presents itself, you know, and saying in the offense believes that, you know, that's where we should start leaning more towards to, then I'm definitely going to take advantage of it. But if they feel confident with, with our ability to keep taking shots, you know, I'm down with that as well. Because I can play, you know, I can play football. You know, I've been doing it my whole life. You know, I don't necessarily look at numbers. You know, um, they said uh, Vic didn't have a great you know, completion percentage his first couple of years. You know, and he's probably one of the greatest quarterbacks to ever do it. So I don't necessarily look at numbers. You know, I just look at each play. You know, for itself. Because you know, I, I don't have the the ability to control every single thing that happen every play. You know, I can only control what I can control, and I'm just trying to do my part out there. So if my numbers are low, man, they just low. I just got to pick them up, and I just got to play better. 
Yeah, for sure. Yeah, man, it hurts, bro. Like, the defense, they be playing, you know, balls to the wall, man. Excuse me for saying that. But, you no, know, they, they be playing great. You know, they be doing their thing. And they gave us two opportunities right there, you know, take advantage of the game and, you know, just go win it. But, you know, we didn't, we didn't do that to the best of our ability. So, uh, you know, we just got to, you know, execute next time. No, it feels good seeing JT out there because, man, as you can see, he gets the ball in the same. He make it work. He, he makes some plays. But just having, you know, all of the, the, the playmakers in the, in the game, just, you know, just making plays. Like when, when JT goes out, you got Goody and, and Trey coming in right there. They make plays as well. You know, the wide out swapping as well, and the tight ends be swapping. So any, anybody that's on the field, we, we're expecting them to make plays, and JT be doing that. Man, you got to take it, you know, like a grain of salt because, you know, people are going to say it's my fault. You know, uh, I definitely could have played better today. You know, I definitely could have delivered the ball better. Definitely could have made some better checks. You know, I, I could have played better. So I definitely understand that. Uh, even when we play well and we win the game, they're going to say uh, AR was the, the main reason we won. So you just got to be able to take both sides of it, you know, the wins and the losses. So I'm just steady trying to grow and just keep being better. Josh Downs, I mean, you feel like he's pretty explosive today. Is that something you guys can yeah, for sure. But uh, we, we more so want to get everybody involved as well because, you know, there's opportunities. You know, like I said, when J, J, uh, JD's out there eating, you know, I'm delivering him the ball. You know, some teams are going to start doubling him. So that gives give everybody else the opportunity to get open and just make some plays. So you got to take advantage of when everybody else is, is out there, you know, and they just giving us the, the, the go balls and the, the quick slants and all that. You got to take advantage of it. But, man, shout out JD for just making some plays out there.